Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to verify Google Search Console on Shopify store in 2023. So we're going to focus on a crucial step, of course, to enhance your store visibility, which is verifying Google Search Console. So if you're ready to improve your site's performance on Google, stick around and I'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process of verifying Google Search Console on your Shopify store in 2023 so make sure to stick by let's dive right into this video and simply let's get started before we start with this video make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience first we'll have to go and access your shopify dashboard do so go and open whatever browser we're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with here in my case i'm actually going to use the brave browser and of course in your case it could be any other browser that you could possibly have once you open that browser, go to the CRL section and basically just type shopify.com and hit the enter button. This should take you into the home screen or main screen of shopify.com. And of course, if you know something about Shopify, that's cool. If you don't, just scroll down, read more information about it, familiarize yourself, or just have a general idea about it. You can see what people saying about it, videos, some insights, uh, frequently asked questions, and etc. And of course, if you have an account, go to the top right corner, click on login to log into your account. And if you don't have an account, instead click on start free trial to create a new account, and you'll get a free uh, three days free trial on every store that you create and you'll be able to try everything but the store will turn inactive and after the free after, after the free trial ends which is after three days unless you go and get one of their plans as you can see uh, there are this is the plans that they have the prices monthly and yearly with the features you can pause the video and check it all by your own for me i'll just go here and click on login and this should log me into my store right away because i logged in recently so i don't have to uh, add uh, or enter my credentials over and over whatever I'm logging in into my store. So once you log in your store, you will basically be on the Shopify dashboard right away. So what we said we want is we would like to verify the Google Search Console on Shopify store. What you will need to do is simply go to preferences. Where you will find preferences, simply go to this left panel and here, go to online store, click on that. And as you can see, you'll find here themes, blog posts, pages navigation and preferences simply go and click on those preferences section and here you will find these option right here so preferences title meta description social sharing image google analytics google pixel custom privacy password protection and spam protection so what you want to do in here is simply go to the password protection and you will have to remove the password to have access to so can google search console have access to your store with this password they will not be able to so if you go here to navigation you'll have to remove the password as an example your online store is password protected only visitors with your password can access your store to let anyone browse and shop remove the password but if you click on remove the password you will have to go and pick a plan one of their plans so you can remove the password in your free uh, trial those three days free trial in your store you'll not be able to remove the password so uh, you'll not be able to verify the google search console so remove the password go and pick a plan for yourself and remove the password then you'll be able now to verify it on the google search console what you'll have to do simply go and open a new tab go to google search console or type google search console and here you'll find like google search console tools but we'll have to click on sign in to continue to google search console just go and click on that and here as you can see you'll find welcome to google search console to start select the property type do you have a domain all urls across the top domains all urls across http or s or http or required dns verification or do you have a url prefix only urls under entered address or urls under specific uh, specified protocol or allowed multiple verification methods so for us as an example for the store it should be a domain your store should contain or should have a domain like if you go here to your store go to this left panel as an example go to settings right here and in here you will find and yeah domains right here and as you can see you'll find the domain name of your store right here so now go to search console and here you'll have to enter the domain or the sub domain of your store so simply just go and copy that domain in here as you can see you'll find that right there so simply copy it and come here and paste it down click on continue 
and then as you can see you will have to verify the domain ownership via dns record so you'll have to select the record type uh, that you want to like uh, verify that with is a txt which is recommended or the c name then you'll have to sign in into your domain provider which is godaddy namecheap for us of course it's like uh, shopify so we'll have to go and do that in here then you'll have to copy that and click on please verify of course this may take like one minute if you change like uh, the record type so you'll have to wait for one day at least i guess to make the changes then you can come back here and click on verify of course if you have like another domain name that you want to change you can always go here to domain and you can click on connect an existing domain enter the domain that you want to exist as example that you own i don't know maybe uh i'll just type this one's example click on next and of course you will have oh i forgot like the dot com and of course then you will have to connect into uh, it into it right now so you can click on connects automatically connects manually connects manually you will have to enter those values again into the record which is takes record or you can simply go and do the connection uh, automatically if you want to so go back in here i'll just go and enter that again dot com click on next and here make sure to go and click on connects automatically and as you can see this domain is connected to godaddy so we'll have to connect your account on godaddy sign in and verify your ownership now you can simply list the domain name that you have or the example or you can buy domain name from shopify and of course once you do so just change it to your store once you change it to your store enter that right here so just sorry remove and remove just enter that url in here click and continue do the changes that they are telling you to do and come back one day after click on verify and you will be good to go you already like successfully now verified your google search console on your shopify store you can of course now uh, do whatever you want with it and yeah you'll be basically good to, good to go so as a summary of course make sure to go to your online store and make sure to remove the password of your store to do so you'll have to go and get a plan after that you will have of course to go to google search console enter the url here of your store uh, if it's a uh, url that's already has or uh, url given by uh, shopify Whatever it is, just go and enter it right here. Change the uh, record that they are telling you to. You'll have to wait, I guess, at least one day. Then come back here, click on verify, and you will be good to go. Of course, you can even install some apps here in Shopify that will help you improve this search on your store like they're giving you even here shopify search and discovery customize your storefront search and discovery experience and basically in this shopify app store uh, you will find a lot of apps that could be uh, very very useful for your store so i guess that's it for me for you congratulations you've successfully verified your google search console on your shopify store so thank you for joining me today and thank you for watching if you like this video make sure to leave a like down below subscribe to our channel for more health stories like this one and i will see you in the next video